TV, both great companies, you know, both number one brands, uh, you know, out there. And I have, I've had those TVs for years and years and years and years. Right. I am really tempted to get the new Samsung because the Sony that I have in my main living area, it's, it's not really, it's not ultra high HD. It's not 4K. It has a nice picture. It was the best picture at the time. That TV is seven years old. So again, back to my point, I don't worry so much about the warranty. I think it's nice that we doubled it up, but what your concern should be right now is how big do I want to go? And how much money do I want to save? Remember, we are doing the 43 inch at only 579. And if you've priced 85 inch TVs, 2499 and the ability to pay over time, over 18 months is crazy. All right, because that's, right. that's the blockade. <laughs> hey, I don't have 2,500 bucks in my account right now. Well, what do you have? Can you, can you afford, you know, $40 a month? Can you afford 50? Can you afford 80? Uh, what was the 18-month the, the VIP for the 85-inch, Pat? Do you remember offhand? I think it was 138. 18? There it is. $138 a month. So what do you spend when you go out to the movie theater? Let's say you bring you and your yeah. wife and, uh, or your husband and your three kids. That's five people. I haven't been to the theater in a while, but I'm, I'm guessing it's probably 10 to $15 per person. So you're at about $65, $75 right there. All right, now you get popcorn and all, you're probably at 100 bucks, maybe 138, right? <laughs> and that's for one visit to the movie theater. Cause you gotta drive the car, you got gas, you got parking, you get all that. 138 a month and, and you own a movie theater. I mean, you literally mm -hmm. own a movie theater. Whether you go 75, which is this one, um, I can take you on a little tour if you'd like. I've got a, uh, this 65 inches over here. I've got the 43 inch. Um, can I walk over there? Is that okay? Do you guys mind? So this is the 65 inch. Um, don't worry, I'm, I'm not actually getting bigger. <laughs> the TV's just a little <laughs> bit smaller. But you see, when I look at this, see now this would be the size that I would love right here. Um, but it's all personal preference, but I think this to me is a, this is what I would call a jumbo TV at 65 inches, and you get an idea of how big that is. And remember, this is on a table. Put this up on a wall, it's gonna be have an even a more grandiose effect on everybody that's watching it, but get it home. There's a sound bar, by the way, that I was talking about. Yep. Good idea if you can afford it to get the sound bar. Uh, why wait till later, get it all done, get your entertainment good to go. Um, over in the other room, I'm gonna walk over there if you don't mind. Take my time. This is actually the, is this, this the 43? And by the way, if you've got a spare room or a guest room or a bedroom or a kid's room, this is the 43 inch right here. That's still a really, really big TV. Let me just tell you, my main TV in my room, in my house is 43 inches. This is, this is my big TV, all right? Granted, the only reason I don't have a bigger TV is because I had a, a built-in put over my fireplace. So I got a fireplace down here and then I have a built-in and it's 44 inch, 45 inches going corner to corner. The only TV I can put in there right now, unless I open it up bigger, is a 43 inch. So that may be perfect, but let me tell you, for a guest room, for a kid's room, for, uh, you know, for, for your bedroom, if you wanna put a TV in there, it's perfect for that as well. <laughs> so you really can't get wrong, uh, go wrong with any of the sizes <laughs> that we have available. And Bill, you know, the technology, when you, when you were talking to the TV and then turning the lights on, my, my head started to <laughs> swell up. I'm just like, because I can't do any of that with the TV that I own. Here Here's kind of the stack of cards right there that shows you all the TVs that we have available for you right now. Don't wait on this. Of all the stuff that you've been through over the past, whatever it is you've been through it, you know, I don't know what it is, 18, 19, 20 months now, I don't know. Uh, you probably deserve to give yourself a little bit of a break and enjoy this holiday season. Um, mm -hmm. And you will, I, I, you know, every time you walk into the room and you pop a, a, a Blu-ray in or you're streaming a movie or whatever it is, or you're just watching the news or the sporting events, you know, when, when the big game comes, you know, when football's here and you're like, oh, I'm so excited to have friends over. I've got my QLED uh, 4K TV. They're gonna be blown away. And it was a worthwhile investment and it is an investment. You're gonna have this TV for many, many, many years. <clears throat> so, you know, when you think about it, you have a car for how long? Long. You have a car for maybe three years, four years, five years. There are those of us that keep the, the cars until the very end. But, you know, you're hard pressed to get any more than three to five years out of a vehicle. Um, that either you're going to trade it in, you're going to sell it. You're going to have these TVs well beyond that. 
Okay, that, that, is, right. that is the quality that you will have. I have a Samsung TV that is, I guess, seven, it's about, gotta be 17 years old. I hate to admit that I'm that old, but I am. Um, but, but it still is just like the day I bought it. I mean, you know, these, yeah. these, LED, these <laughs> LED TVs do not burn out. They're not like the old fashioned picture tubes. They don't need a fan inside. They don't run at 130 degrees. You know, I, I had a plasma TV once. That thing cost me $25 a day to run. I had a giant jumbo plasma. It was as big as the house, right? It was back in the day. I thought I was really cool. I'm going to buy a plasma TV. Oh my gosh, that thing was brutal. It had to have clearance on top because it was like an oven. So you're not going to have to deal with that. Runs cool, runs long, runs smooth. It is the ultimate in high definition. And as I mentioned earlier, QLED, the quantum dots, which are basically the little pixel, little, little elements of color that fill that screen, create billions of color combinations. Um, the, the QLED versus the OLED, uh, the, Q, the quantum really means that you're going to get richer saturation of those main colors of your uh, red, green, and blue. And so you get 100% of the color volume, the saturation, that allows for greater, greater contrast. And contrast realistically is everything when it comes to picture quality. You know, the contrast is how do things stand out as they relate to color? right? As opposed to like sound. When you think of sound, you know, there are different levels of sound, your bass and your treble and all the other things that, that are involved in sound, how the sound is emitted. All that stuff gives you a total sound picture. Well, it's the same with a TV. All that saturation gives you that incredible difference in contrast, which makes things pop. Look at that picture. Perfect example. Deep, dark contrast on the building, bright, colorful contrast in the back, and then that water in it, in that deeper color, that's what creates that picture that sucks you in, all right? And that's what it is all about. When I sit down in front of a, a TV, a big screen TV and a movie, I wanna be sucked in. I wanna be enveloped by that TV, and Bill, that's what this TV will do for you. In any room, wherever you put it, for years to come. I love how you were talking about how much you invest in a car. I don't, there's days I don't even get in the car, but every day I'm turning on the TV. Every day right. I'm road tripping in front of this because I'll sit in front of it for hours and that's how I'm connected. So I get it's an investment, but you're investing in the number one brand, which is great. Their latest technology. Guy, you're talking about those older televisions. Does it even have Bluetooth? I mean, this TV has Bluetooth. Is it as smart as this television is? Because even the way we stream has been elevated in terms of the options, in terms of the speed and how long it takes to download and to upload to enjoy it. And that also affects the clarity. So the clarity is gonna be there because of the screen, the saturation of the colors, because it is the Q series of televisions. And we highlight that a lot because that is the top tier from Samsung, because you're not just getting bargain basement entry level price, you're getting top quality specs, technology. And if the light demonstration confused you guys, guess what? You have that two year warranty, you also have the peace of mind of knowing that you're getting the technology of today, but it's going to grow with you, which is great. And yes, every night can be movie night. And you don't have to wait until everyone gets off of work or until 740 when the show starts. You can download an app. You can download the content. And I know you're a big Hallmark movie fan guy. I went to the app store on here. They have the Hallmark movie channel. Enjoy what you want. And you know what's cool? That's great if you can connect your Blu-ray and all that kind of stuff. But what about the stuff that we don't have that we want to watch? You know, I want to watch Field of Dreams. How do I go find it? Do I log in and out of Netflix and Hulu and, and all of those who have to spell it out letter by letter? How simple is it? One, there's cheat buttons, little quick uh, Netflix button, Samsung TV Plus, which I'll tell you what that is. That's free television. But I hold down the microphone button. Field of Dreams. It's going to find my movie. It's going to find the actor. It's going to find it on all those different platforms. And this is built in. Boom, Field of Dreams. I'm just happy I didn't even have to spell it all, which is great. Come over here. Where are more options? Apple TV. Oh, Prime, Voodoo, Redbox. Oh, Peacock. I already have a subscription to that. I don't have to pay. This is where it's just so simple no matter how we use the television. But let's be real. We all use TVs. We enjoy it. And when you're talking about the sizes, trust me. I was always limited on what size I could put in my house, not based on the furniture or the placement, but what would fit in the car. And that's really what excites me. All of these are gonna ship to your door by appointment, so it's not gonna be sitting out there. And you notice in that picture, the soundbar fits underneath the television. Because in this new model, you can actually adjust, get about an inch more of clearance on those legs. That's if you're using the stand. You can also wall mount it. So there's so many great features in here that Samsung has included because we all have problems with our TVs. Want to put it into ambient mode? Because once that happened, 
all of a sudden we're sitting down, company's coming over, it's time to do homework, turn off the TV. You're not gonna have the big black square that's just sitting there in the bedroom, the office, or the big 85 inch square in the living room. You can customize it to match the wall art, to add family photos, and boom. Now it's not an eyesore, it's, and this is when the TV's turned off. Yet when you turn it on, that's really when it steps up. The audio's in there too, is just great cue symphony sound. It's adaptive to the special effects, to the dialogue. Oh, here's something, so here's HSN, right? Samsung TV Plus, live television. Why is that cool? Maybe I put this 43 inch in the office. I don't have a cable box out there, but I have Wi-Fi, so I can come over here and to watch all these great Wi-Fi options. Let's back down this, boom. You're gonna notice the channel light up. QVC, HSN, stuff for the crafters, stuff for the home enthusiasts, DIY, even the sports fans. I hit the right button over here, boom. It's gonna give me all of these great options in terms of channel placements, but more importantly, it's options we can all relate to because we love our TVs. We use it all the time. Is it as convenient as not having to worry about the remote because there's a solar panel that's gonna recharge it? They even finally put a USB charging port. You can charge it that way if you want to as well, because why? We charge our cell phones all the time. Why can't we just charge up our remote? So they really have thought of a lot of great conveniences in this television that you're going to use and enjoy all the time. And guy, I know you say you've been you've been in HSN a while. Do you ever recall 18 months of financing? This no. is they've really gone big for this because remember we have not had a Samsung <clears throat> Today Special television in over a year, and no. the next one's close to the end of the year. Yeah, no, that's a really good deal. And again, that 18 month fine. Excuse me, that 18 month financing is on all the larger TVs. So from the 60 all the way up to the 85, you're gonna get uh, you're gonna get 18 months. You get 12 on the first two size TVs. I mean, they're a lot less expensive and, the, and that's relative to the price. So it's a great, great deal. Uh, on the 43 inch, uh, it's only $48 a month for 12 months. And on the 50 inch, it's only $56 a month for 12 months. So less time, it's actually, you know, if you want those size TVs, it's great. You don't have to pay for them as long. So I wanted to bring out the box that this TV comes in <laughs> it's pretty big let's see how big my wingspan is so this is this is this is the box um, and the reason I, I bring this out is how would you get this in your car how, I mean you, you would probably have to have and you probably would have to have some kind of crazy SUV or a, or a you probably would have to have a pickup <coughs> truck right or yep. schedule some kind of delivery we will take care of that for you and deliver it right to your door it's it's a hey it, it's it's a blockade for a lot of people how are we going to get that tv home it's going to take a forget it you know it gives people a, a moment for pause and they won't buy it so we will deliver that to your house absolutely no problem how exciting when that box comes. Guy knocks on the door, right? Nut, 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 and then he comes in and that box comes rolling into your house. It is unbelievable. Don't look for a reason not to buy this TV today. Look for every reason you have to buy it because I'm telling you, if the TV season is here. I always say TV season starts at the end of summer. It's when baseball heats up. It's when mm -hmm. football starts for me. All the holidays start. You know, Bill, I love, love, love that ambient feature. That is huge because right. a, lot of, you know, a lot of you right now are, are maybe having the discussion with your partner and one partner might be saying I am not having that giant thing <laughs> up there on the wall when it's not on it'll look ridiculous so put a portrait of your kids on it put a yeah. holiday picture up there if it's Halloween put a scary Halloween you're having a party put a scary Halloween picture up there right you know, put put uh, Michael Keaton as Beetlejuice right in the middle, a big picture of him. <laughs> just freeze that, and, or you could just make it a beautiful portrait. You can make it artwork. It can look like a painting. When it's not in use, you can change that to any image that you want. Just one of the myriad features that this TV has. I hope you get the one that you want. Again, we have every size from 43 to 50 to 60 to 65, 75, and 85. Uh, you've got VIP financing on all the TVs, so 12 month for the first two, 18 month for the other four. Uh, that lowers your price in and around anywhere from 50 up to about $138. So you can get it home, you'll absolutely love it. It's free shipping and handling. The <laughs> item number, one more time, write it down. I know you're thinking about it. 076512. Bill Duggan, thank you, buddy. Good job. Good. Have a good day, guy. I couldn't find Beetlejuice, but I found a picture of this guy on the TV. I, so, I think it, every home in America should have that as their ambient still. Look at that. <laughs> right? Exactly. If you're ever feeling I down, agree. just check out Guy and Bill. <laughs> Why anyway. not?